Hello everyone! Welcome back to another video, and I'm pretty sure the audio is right in this one like it was in the others, because I haven't changed anything. But if it's not, I'm gonna die and cry at the same time. But anyway, we're following Niccolò Machiavelli. And I wasn't looking at the screen when I said that. I thought that was Niccolò talking then. What did he say? We recently began traveling through the tunnel to avoid the guard, but many of the entrances in the city are broken. Oh god, a broken gate! What do we do? Destination rapidly without encountering resistance. Sorry, it's ridiculous. Um. Oh, okay, let's just let's just go to Tiber Island hideout. We're not into the action yet, guys. We're not into the pure action. And we're about six episodes. This is the sixth episode. So that tells me that I'm either doing these too short, as I've seen playthroughs of people are doing this stuff on the second. But I'm not, like, doing full hour playthroughs. Um, nobody's going to watch, like, full hours. Jesh. Fabio Orsini, at your service. I've heard a great deal about you from my cousin. Bartolomeo D'Anviano. A fine warrior. Fabio has lent us in a new storeroom on Isola Tiberina. I know you were used to better accommodations in Toscana. It is perfect. Bene. Then I am off to begin preparations for Romagna. Today, Cesare commands my men, but soon, I hope we will be free. <coughs> now I propose we begin planning our assault on the Borgia. Oh. You think we are ready for such an attack? See, si. Do you know, for instance, where the Borgia troops took Caterina Sforza? What? Are you also unaware that the Borgia have captured the Apple of Eden? How could we have lost the Apple? So, you do not know what goes on with our enemies. Do we at least have an underground here to work with? Hardly. Our mercenaries are ensnared in a losing battle with Cesare's French allies. We have girls working for us in a brothel, frequented by cardinals and other important Romans. But the madam there is lazy, and would rather attend parties than further our cause. What about the city's thieves? Do they have a guild? See, si, but they refuse to talk to us. I don't know why. What are you going to do? Make some friends. Yay! That was the, probably one of the best lines in the franchise, actually. I'm not gonna lie, I love that line, it's so brilliant. Can I jump out this door yet? I don't think I can with the world deteriorating around me. I'm not quite sure I can... No, no, definitely not. Run up the stairs quickly, Ezio! <laughs> um, before the world blows up behind you. Uh, Jesus Christ. That is what happened, isn't it? Oh look, loading screens. Oh, that's cool. The fight of the lover and the thief. Oh, this is pretty interesting. We're going to probably do this bit because this bit's quite fun. Uh, oh, ooh, 60 frames look beautiful. New items unlocked at a blacksmith. Oh, why do I not care? But oh god, those frame drops. So oh, that, that dive. Even this game has the optimization is patchy in all Assassin's Creed games. No matter how good your PC is. You're always going to get these really, really, really weird, like, lag spikes from time to time. Luckily for me, it's quite rare, but if you start singing to me, I will kill you. I just want to kill you, your friend, because I can. <coughs> then you, because that's how the combat logic applies in this world. Uh, sorry, I'm still a little bit coffee, and it's been six days since I last uploaded the video of this game. Last, that sounds very southern. Yeah, I, I was born in the south of the country, so I may actually have a bit of a southern accent that peeps through every now and then, just if you didn't notice. So, and I came to the north when I was about seven, which was ages ago. Uh, so I do, I have adapted to the accent for some apparent reason. Oh, that, that means that the, um... We'll just go this way. Just go do it. Just do it. Sup. Well, because, yeah, that logic.
Well, that worked, didn't it? Okay. So, <coughs> oh, I love throwing people into the water. Oh, look, should we do this? Should we do this? Yeah, we'll, we'll do this. This is why they detected me. It's a restricted area. Lucrezio. You know, in fact, I want to leave this as an activity to do on stream. Because I'm going to end up playing Brotherhood on a stream someday. Uh, I already have done it before. Oh, look, a gondola. Wait, is it a gondola? Yeah, it's a gondola. Just jump over it. And lose your detection. And everyone will still see you somehow. Uh, okay, just run. Call the horse. So, uh, how far away are we from our objective? Does does horse jump? Oh, horse is bamf. Horse is bamf, man. Horse is bamf. Horse is bay. Horse is bay. Horses Bay. Just jump off. There we go. Because logic. Oh, look, this is the Thieves' Den. I thought... I didn't know we were this far to get to Thieves. Whoa! So the guy just climbed that thing. Then join me. In aiding Machiavelli? No, thank you. That man is a traitor to our order. A serious allegation coming from a thief. What is your proof? He was an ambassador to the papal court and traveled as a personal guest of Cesare himself. I also know he abandoned you right before the villa attack. <laughs> Alright, yeah, this is going to be so brilliant. I'm just liking how they're arguing over nothing. Look in his eyes. Uh, he is meeting someone in the Trastevere right now. Care to accompany me? I will follow. I I am at so I thought it'd be like Damn you, Gandalf! Um, yeah, I'll just. If you guys don't remember the damn you, Gandalf thing, you haven't been here since 2014. Well, mid 2014. Your voice is loud. It's a perk of a salesperson, isn't it? So the lighting suddenly changes for a mission. Oh god, god you grabbed it. You, you did that. You know, earlier I was in a really bad mood. Didn't think I'd be actually making any videos today. Now I'm in a nice mood. And I have no idea why. Everyone being a bit of a douche today, I guess. Well, I'm, I'm being a douche as well. Yeah, I was, it was me and a friend were just watching a clip earlier. And we were just having... Ooh, well, we, we both saw a clip. And we were now discussing the physics of the clip. Because it involves some guy whacking a guy in the face with a pole and he goes flying into another pole. It's a, it's a good 30 meters away from him. Uh, which is kind of ridiculous. Oh look. That gets ridiculous. <laughs> Dank storm. Dank. Oh crap. Oh. Ezio, that was stupid. Yeah, I know. You don't have to play this really patronising music. I know that there's the mission that's interesting. Oh, it's just making the situation seem douche. Just sweet Charlie, innit? Don't know if that's racist or not. It probably is racist, actually. I'm sorry if I offended anyone by saying that. I don't sometimes think, and in like these Let's Play like videos, it's kind of difficult to say. So, uh, I'm gonna shut up now before I hurt people. Looks like Doctor Z is dead. Go for it. I'm coming for you. Don't 
Tell us my impaling. Oh, you didn't. You didn't just go there. Yes, you did. I'm sorry. He went there. So did you. But you're going to die now, innit? Oh, God. You hurt me. I'm going to kill you. My camera angle's gone really weird. Claudio's hurt. Yeah, he can still wield a knife. Follow me. And I will have you killed. Then with the crowd to get to the, to the vault. The Volpe, without being noticed. I'm okay with being noticed, to be honest with you. Alright, just keep going. Follow me, Claudia. Keep following me. Sorry about that, we had a little bit of an interruption. Let's blend. I forget they're gonna kill him. They're going to kill all Claudia. I so want to call him Cloudy Lemonadia. Oh, I can't go that way, can we? We have to go round. That's the crowd we really need. So stick with these guys, yeah? I'm a realist, innit? Where are you party monkeys going? Oh, this way, okay. No, I'm hit, I'm hit. I kill, I blame you. <laughs> that was so morbid. It turned into a bloodbath because I was down the street from Claudius. Or was it Claudio? Claudio, Claudius. I've been... Claudio, I've been doing much ha too much Hamlet. <laughs> you know when somebody's been obsessed with Hamlet when they start talking about Claudius. No, I'm, no, I'm just, no, really, it's a GCSE. I have to. It's literally the law. I'll have to go this way, Claudio. Okay, because... Okay, do not kill cloud groups. Crowd! Cloud! Get in this crowd quickly. We're going. That pushed me out of blend real quick, didn't Ah, uh, hate when there are people on the. I hate when films are so like. I just hate it when um. It does the physics of the game don't work. The dynamic of the game is broken. I need to hire some prostitutes for a good time. No, just to get past these guards. Because these two little buggers here are just going to drive a wrench into my arms. Can't fast walk. This is annoying. Maybe there's now there's no guy sat there cross legged. We might actually get past under deck. Oh, there's no guards either. There are no guards. Hmm, this is very odd indeed. Uh, what the bloody hell did you come from? Poppins? Don't worry, we're almost there now. We're al this is the hardest mission in the entire game. I swear down on my grand pigeon's life. But this is the hardest mission in the entire game. What? Uh, no, I'm here, I'm here. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Found... <laughs> Don't worry, we're here, we're here, we're here. Claudio. 
Molte grazie, Messini. Keep out of sight for a while. Desi? The guards are looking for you. I see they are porters out. Then rip them down. You can pay the heralds to Florence who stains them. Or I can eliminate witnesses. <laughs> you know how to disappear. Now what am I doing? Oh, I'm meant to lose the notoriety. Makes pretty much enough sense. Oh, Ezio, you don't have to fall through a wall. We all know that you have you have a very bad birthday. Uh. Hi. I always do that. <laughs> no idea why. I'd rather rip off this wanted poster. Really. At the Thieves Guild, oh, the ragged flag, and do we go? Oh, nobody will get that unless they are Elder Scrolls fans. Um, then they might get the ragged flag and joke, but I doubt any Assassin's Creed fan who hasn't played it at the Elder Scrolls games will get it. Unless they've heard of it. That, that, um, unless you have the odd one, which would, would make sense. It's always the odd one, but what am I talking about, really? It's white. He's white, just like Ezio. When that didn't come out quite like I expected it to. Just keep running, all right? Just keep running. No, you didn't see anything. What does it to gallop on PC? I'm sure. Oh, what the hell have I done? I honestly have no idea as to what I have done. This is what I say like every day of my life. Um, hello, level. What a night this has been. It's daytime. Hey, listen to me. I know what we saw, but you have nothing to fear from Machiavelli. I am sure of it. I have you to thank for saving Claudio's life. If you believe Machiavelli remains loyal to the order, I trust you. So, what of the thieves? We had plans to repair this old building, but. Now that you and I are working together, I would like to know what you think. We need to make sure the Borgias stay away. Perhaps it could look like an inn. Yes. Hmm, I like that idea. Then I will make it so. I'm talking to you! Yeah, we'll pay. Whoa! Looks fabulous! Like a house. Now we're gonna go in and start dancing around like little idiots. Oh, wow. The sleeping fox. There might be objectives to pursue that will help our cause in the city. I see you thieves compete against each other. You can participate if you wish. Perhaps you will show them a thing or two. Ah, yes, I forgot. We also have gambling. It is a great source of income, especially since we ensure that the Borgia guards always lose. One last thing. I need your spies to find the apple. It has been taken from you. A Borgia guard have ne has never yes, A Borgia guard has never won a gambling game in the Sleeping Fox. In it has become part of legend, part of fear. I would like to know what I have done. This is weird. Let let's go out of here. That door is shiny. I like to fancy. Um, are oh, the lighting around here is. I'm sorry to say, but this this game I expected better from it. Really, the optimization-wise, since I'm on a really high end PC for the time, the PC is about two years ahead of the game itself, which is is, is a two, 2012. 
builds and we still have the fluctuations of the optimization so I expected better but then again it's Ubisoft so I can't say much since I played Unity and that is 10 times worse 10 times is a bit low 100,000.6 billion times worse See up which the closest is. Okay, where are the... that's the closest. And it's all the way across the map. Don't worry, I'm going, I'm going, I'm going, okay? I'm going. Yes. 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 Oh, there goes my internet. Well, oh, penis. Who cares about the internet while I'm recording, anyway? That might be a bit of a worry. I'm sure my internet connection will re-establish itself in a second, but until then, we are completely disbanded. That doesn't sound great. I don't know where... I don't know whose arse I'm talking out of now. I just realised how heavily influenced my channel is from friends, and I mean, I know several friends who have, uh, like, you know, influenced things I say on my channel, like, see ya, that was from Adam. Yarp was from my friend XNerdXWaffleX, also known as Kristen. Uh, don't tell him I told him you, my, ident well, his identity. He, I don't think he likes me to concealing his, well, disclosing even his identity on camera. <laughs> Sack it. He just now you know he who Kristen man is. Oh sh sugar. Now you know who Waffle Man is. Why is it like so limey around here? Ev the lighting is so bright in this part of the game. This puts Unity to shame. Just saying. This is like Italian Creed Unity. That, that sounded racial. Oh, connection to server resumed. See what I mean by my internet re-establishing itself. And yeah, I wasn't trying to be racist then. I was actually making myself a little... It wasn't a very funny joke, was it? Okay, it wasn't a funny joke. Moving on. At least I make better jokes than my graphics teacher. I shouldn't really say that because you might actually be watching my video right now. That'll, that would be slightly worrying. Um... Because I'm not sure my YouTube channel is. This is probably the best example I'd be saying. But okay. Welcome to the Rose and Fiore, stranger. Hello. Would you be kind enough to call the owner for me? Madonna Solari is not in. Do you know where she is? I. Are you sorry? Madonna Solari! A Lucia! We thought you were gone for good. The men took us on a ship. And they released me, but she. Who took you on a ship? Traitor, Messere, near Isola Tiberina. They want gone in exchange for her life. I will get her back. Or at least her corpse. That might... You know, I am assuming that everyone who watches this get walkthrough has kind of played this game on, on the road. Otherwise, I have no idea where you're watching this playthrough, because really... I'd rather have people experience the game first-hand than backseat game on my channel. What? Oh god, there goes the full sink! Do not swim! I landed in the water. It suddenly became a crime. Land on the gondola! You know, suck it, the gondola is not very manoeuvrable around here. We have 3,365 3, out of 2,500 florins. This somehow works. Okay, just, it should just say, go pay the gondola now. Just 
hurry away from your victim to avoid being caught. Victim. Victim. He calls them victims. Alright, I somehow doubt that they're victims, but okay. You know what, we're just gonna keep running, keep running, keep running, keep running. And jump up, 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 up. Ugh. Let's see comes just short on the bottom one, but okay. I wasn't. I haven't actually played anything since Tuesday, so this is the first th Thursday now. I haven't actually record, played any games since then. I am not. I don't actually consider myself to be a heavy gamer anymore. I wish I was a heavy gamer. Well, me and Jack, my friend Jack, we we basically hammer Assassin's Creed Unity from time to time, which is the game's not great, okay, but it's. Brilliant fun. I'm not here. Well, <laughs> I'm not even in this. I'm. Well, I'm not here. Like, you know, up onto the dock we go. I remember this video. Video on YouTube where some guy was just on, well, some woman was just on about women being seen as sexual objects in games. Well, I, I disagree. Well, this scene probably isn't the best time to be talking about this, but it, you can't really judge it on some several scenes. Of course, there will be games like that. It's trying to paint realism. It's trying to add the realism of like what life was like. Of course, it's going to have that in it, but the same at the same time, there are games where men are being caught having the penises cut off and etc. If you didn't really notice, that does happen. And trust me, it's ten times more brutal and it does happen. And besides, that was the scene that they used was that woman being killed back there. And to be honest with you, I've, if you've ever heard of a game, Rise, Son of Rome, you'd feel that that is irrelevant because there are loads of guys being executed. And if you've seen the ads for Assassin's Creed Unity, that everyone from multi genders are being executed. Sometimes even in the streets, everyone's just dying male, female, black, white. And it doesn't matter. There is no segregation in gaming. That actually annoys me a little bit, you know. But why should I be annoyed? Because I might, may as well make a video about it, but I'm not going to... I'm, yeah, I'm going to make a video about segregation in gaming. Expect that to come out uh, soon. I'm not going to put any... Um... Oh, I can see the pixels in the sky. That's annoying. At least it's not like the Oblivion Sky where I've got a grid following me around everywhere now. Ah, oh, Christ. That is annoying when you have a grid following you around everywhere. It's just like, why? Why? Why a grid? Okay, maybe, maybe there is a little bit of segregation in gaming, but... Oh, well. It depends where you go, really. There are some communities that even men avoid. And that is usually the, um... lot of them. There, though, there are a lot of communities that guys avoid. For example, I avoid all the COD players because they're all six-year-olds. <laughs> Come at me, G. That felt like a 30 drop, but it still stayed at 60. That's kind of kind of worrying, but I'm not sure if I have my frame rate counter with me. That's so I can just monitor my game. I know some people don't do that, especially one of my friends. He doesn't like seeing that, because if it's not as high as he thinks it is, it bugs him. And I understand that completely. It would bug me as well. So I just keep my frame rate there, so I'm not disappointed ever. I'm just not very um, happy with most of it. Just open the bl Oh, we have to go around the back, do we? I keep on making this mistake, and it's usually never a good one. Mother? Sister? Excellent. The Machiavelli said that you might be here. What are you doing in Roma? Has Firenze been attacked? No, or rather, I do not know. We did not go to Firenze. Why? It's we want to help. I was trying to help you by sending you to Firenze. 
Where is Madonna Solari? She's dead. Now! Must now. Will we have to close? We cannot close. I need your help. Messere, without someone who can run things, we're finished. I'll do it. You do not belong here, Claudia. I know how to run a business. I ran on Comnarios for years. This is different. What alternative do you have, Ezio? You do this, Claudia. And you are on your own. This is not what he's been trying to negotiate. Fine. I intend to repair the brothel. This place is a real mess. And I want your courtesans to find Katarina Swartz. You can count on us. Ezio was just really, really sinister about that then. It was just like, he, well, he, he was just like a sadist. He didn't even show any emotion. He he just went, basically just went, she's uh, dead. It's like, she's dead. It's like, why? 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 See, even I would show more emotion than that. That is probably the worst scripting that they've got in any character in this part of the game. And this is only this one, like, well, in, this, in the game that's probably the worst line. The worst executed line, anyways. Was like she's dead. Was like, I mean, Roger Craig Smith is a brilliant voice actor and a brilliant what it does. And um, that was just horrible. But the rest of it is so good that we forget about that. As you can see, the most popular brothel in Roma. Lol. He sounds like he's interested in the coitus. You're not teaching them much. Think you could do better? See. The Borgia make it difficult for Claudia's girls. There are several things you could do that would aid them. I will keep that in mind. Anything else? No. Ezio. Did you find Katarina? We are working on it. Bene. Come to see me at Isola Tiberina with her location. Oh, well, so we got 250 florins out of her. Uh... 2,500 florin investment. But anyway, guys, I think we're going to end the video in this side, this lovely little brothel. So thanks for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed. Please like, subscribe, share, comment, and I will see you all in the next one. Thanks for watching, guys. See ya!